All right, Shalom. I want to give all honors and glory praise due to Yahweh by Shem Yahushai, by Shem Rekakadash, the honors and pastors and elders of Great Millstone, peace to Akim that's doing this work on the four corners of the earth, shout out to confusion of face, and a few aqua women that's watching and learning from these videos and from the Akim. Um, I'm going to basically talk about, you know, um, how prayer is important, you know, because it is. Because <clears throat> without prayer, you know, uh, without faith of works is dead, you know. So what I'm gonna do right now, um, I'm gonna get into it. I'm gonna go to uh, Book of Matthew chapter uh, 21 verse 22. In all the in, in all things, whatsoever ye shall ask in prayer, believe ye shall receive. Kind because you know without faith of works is pretty much dead. And, you know, for the man of Yahweh Bashem, uh, Yahweh Shai, we believe in this word. You understand? Because without him, without faith, the works is dead, you know. Um, Slaki Akim. Okay, come I'm uh, read chapter, uh, book of uh, Matthew. Um, 7 verses 7 as and it shall be given you seek and ye shall find you know knock and it shall be open unto you kind you know because you know uh, it'll come to you you know what I'm saying and you know um, ever since I came into this truth coming from Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai you know, uh, I ain't looked back since, you know, and that's pretty much, um, you know, what really made me come to this. Also that Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah, of course, you know, um, I'm about to go into another scripture right quick. You know, bear with me, Aki. Okay, I'm going to go uh, into Book of St. John, chapter 15, verse 16. Ye have not chosen me, but I have chosen you and ordered you that ye shall go and bring forth fruit and that your, your, your fruits shall remain, that whosoever ye shall ask for I mean, asked of the Father in my name, he may give it you, kind, because, you know, you know, prayer, you know, is is, is very important, you know. You know, when Yahweh Bashim Yahshah, you know, uh, we're, we're dead, you know. That's why two-thirds of our people can't get this truth, and that's why they scoff at us for the man that be on the highways and hedges. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, the men have the zeal, you know, because, uh, you know, and, and that's why they like these two thirds, like they fall out. Uh, uh, that was in a uh, camp, in a camp, and they fall out of it, you know what I'm saying? Because the Most High rejected them because they didn't have faith in this, you know, because like, you know, without faith, the works is dead, you know. So like y'all can bear with me.
Bear with me, Haki. I'm, I'm, I'm almost got there. I'm almost there. You know, I um, also wanted to read this too right quick. I want to read Matthew 10 verses, uh, because this is also who we're really doing it for. We're doing it for uh, Yahweh Bashim Yahusha, book of Matthew 10 verses uh, 5 through 7. These 12 Yahusha sent forward and commanded them, saying, Go not into the ways of the Gentiles and into any city of the Samaritans. Enter ye not. But go rather into the lost sheep of the house of Israel, and also go preach, saying that the kingdom of heaven is a king. Kind, because we ready to get the fuck up out this motherfucker, man. You know, you got trannies and faggots running around here. Uh, you try, uh, uh, these Edomites, they know their kingdom is falling. They're trying to have fucking uh, pedophilia. And, and, and you know that's wicked as hard hell. Matter of fact, I'm going to read... Uh, Book of Job, right quick, chapter 9, verses 24. You know. Then you know what time it is. So bear with me, Akin. Because this world is wicked. And that's why we need Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah. Because we, we we ain't got no army. We can't do, you know. You know, they got everything in the world. Because right now, this is the so-called white man's kingdom of heaven. And this is our hell. Uh, Book of Job, chapter 9, verse 24. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of... He, yeah, he covered the faces of the judges thereof. Thereof it is not. And where, and where, and who is he kind? You know, the, the earth has been given to the hand of the wicked. You know, because um, even like uh, before we was in slavery, uh, Judah, Benjamin, and Levi, um, and Europe, you know, the dark ages were really us. You know, that would be the, uh, Byz you know, the Byzantine Empire, you know, and when we fell, it was, it ended up being in the Edomites rule in Europe, it was the, uh, it was the, uh, Byzantine uh, Empire, you know, and also too, uh, and ever since the Edomites came back in, in power around like the, uh, halfway of the 14, 50 hundreds. And they always bring up 1492, like that's the main mark of it. Um, ever since then, you know, the hand has been given to the hand of the wicked. And when them Edomites came in, what they end up doing, iconoclasts, uh, iconoclasts, says, uh, iconoclasts, meaning that like uh, they took like the real faces of how they really look and the skin color that they were. They took all the black images throughout Europe and they, and they, uh, Painted them uh, so-called white, you know, to cover up who the real judges were, because a lot of people don't know, like the uh, like the candy bar you eat, Three Musketeers, that was really all Jake. There weren't no Edomites, you know, uh, Romeo and Juliet. You know, those weren't no Edomites. That was those were uh, that that's a Israelite uh, story by real Israelites. Uh, that movie. Uh, Robin Hood, that's back when we uh, was ruling at the time. That was an Israelite. Those, you know, those were Israelites. You know, when they talk about the story of Robin Hood, that was us. St. Patrick, he's an Israelite. You know, you know, St. Patrick, they don't even know is an Israelite. He's a Benjamite from the tribe of Benjamin, who you would call today as the Jamaicans. Or Trinidad or, or anywhere in the West Indies. You understand? St. Patrick is a so-called black man. Meaning that he's an Israelite. Because think about it. St. Patrick 
You know what he's known for? Dancing, doing the Irish jig. And who, who, who can dance better than Jake? No damn body. All right? So you really got to pay attention and study, you understand, because the so-called white man don't want you to know who you are. And what I mean by that, I'm talking about you Negroes, you Latinos, you Native Americans, you confused and faced have been scattered on the four corners of the earth. You understand this is your history, you know. Um, but yeah, you know, um, I just wanted to bring that up right quick, you know, spirit took over. Uh, but I'm just, you know, basically doing this video because, you know, um, prayer is important, you know. But uh, that's going to be it with me. Um I want to say our honors and glories and praises due to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahushai, Bashim, Rakar Kadash, the honors and apostles and elders of Great Millstone, peace to the Akim that's doing this work on the four corners of earth, and Shalawan, and Babal, 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 Shalawan, and we out this bitch. Shalawan.